Welcome to another in the Omni Legal Group's video series on intellectual property and practice. Today, we bring you a few miles south of Los Angeles to the headquarters of Deco Lighting. Deco is one of the country's leading manufacturers in expert commercial and industrial lighting fixtures. For over a decade, they've been researching and developing environmentally friendly ways to revolutionize the way that you illuminate the world around you. This 85,000 square foot facility is the hub for innovations that have given rise to multiple patents for their inventions and trademarks for the associated brands. Deco's patented technologies include lighting fixtures, LED boards, as well as the future of intelligent lighting systems, the Deco Mesh module. Now, as with any other patented invention, Deco's technologies first begin with a single idea. In the case of Deco Mesh, the Deco innovators created a revolutionary new way to intelligently operate advanced lighting systems. The patent on this invention is geared towards a module that can act as a digital brain and allow your light fixtures to communicate with one another. Now the scope of a patent is defined by the claims and further illustrated by the patent drawings. Patent attorneys spend many long nights trying to flesh out the details of these claims to make sure they're maximizing the scope of their client's invention. Some of the features claimed on the Deco Mesh patent include the ability to receive and store critical data associated with the light fixture, transmit any data received to another module acting as the fixture's brain, as well as to store and transmit data via the lighting fixture's wireless communicator to an independent server. Now what happens if somebody tries to duplicate the patent and invention? This is where attorneys get involved in a practice called patent litigation. Litigation is the process where a patent holder notifies the accused that they may be infringing on their intellectual property and a resolution is sought between the patent holder and the accused. These types of disputes can be resolved in a lot of different ways. Sometimes the two sides agree to a royalty fee. Other times, the accused infringer stops selling their product. Finally, the case can also find its way into court where it will be for a judge or jury to decide the outcome. Now there's clearly a lot to dig into when it comes to securing your company's inventions. This video only scratches the surface on the different ways that patents can be used to shield your company's intellectual property. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank Deco Lighting for opening up their business to us and helping you learn a little bit more about how intellectual property affects you. They're working day and night to revolutionize the way that we all think about lighting. To learn more about the exciting inventions that are happening here at Deco Lighting, visit the link below. Until next time, I'm Omid with the Omni Legal Group, and I'll see you in the next video.